Hi everybody, my name is Tom Jarvis. Um, this is my first tutorial. I thought I would start with a nice difficult one, <laughs> try and uh, make it interesting. Uh, I'm going to try and teach you how to play Ben Howard's uh, The Fear. It's a beautiful track, um, full of various different uh, riffs and stuff like that. But I'm going to try and keep it as simple as possible um, and make it nice and easy for you guys to uh, learn. So uh, let's start with the tuning um, and then we'll get on to it. Okay, the tuning uh, is in open C. I believe. Um, the first string, the E string top E, is tuned into a C, uh, then it's a G on the A string, then a C, then two G's, and then a C. So just go through it again, it goes C, G, C, G, G, C. Hmm, can you see my hand there? The bottom one is a C. So it's C, G, C, G, G, C. Okay, that's the tuning. Uh, the video I learned it from uh, the capo, or Ben Howe played it with the capo on the third fret. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to do the same. Uh, but I believe on the uh, track from the actual CD, uh, the album, I think it plays on the fourth fret. Um, so let's go, this is the intro. Right, this is the intro, okay. We've got the tuning, uh, we've got the capo on the third fret. Uh, it starts, the video I think is slightly different to the actual track on the album, uh, but it's pretty close. Uh, ben Howe plays it on the start on the 12th fret. I'll play it full speed, I'll slow it right down, and then you guys can kind of copy it. Um, it starts on the 12th fret here. Full speed is... Okay, that's the riff. Um, I don't know if you can see my hand. Hang on, let's try lifting up a little bit. Um, this time, I'll slow it down. Okay, it starts on the 12th, it goes back to this. Between the 12th fret, 10th fret, 5th, 7th, and then open. That's basically the frets that you need. So I'll slow it right down, it goes. And then a slap, ready for the, the verse riff. Um, that intro is used a little bit later on in the song as well, so once you learn that, remember it, um, because it's going to be used later on. Uh, okay, that's the intro. Now for the verse, um, after the intro, so after it finishes, and then it slaps, it goes into... starts on the A string, it's between the A string on the 5th fret, the D string on the 7th and the 5th and the open. Okay, so I play that, the A string with my index finger, D string on the 7th with my pinky, uh, I don't know if you can see that, I'll move a bit closer. Okay, and the D string on the 5th with my middle, so between there and then pull off with the middle. So you, basically my Pretty much my index finger stays on the whole time whilst I'm doing that riff. Okay, so all you're doing is goes one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, that's pretty much the rhythm you need for the pick. Uh, it goes one, two. Okay, so I'll try and do it slowly. Uh, it took me about two weeks to be able to just do this bit. Um, you go, so I'll do it slowly, it goes. open and does the same on the D string. Stops there and then it goes into the... Okay, that riff starts on the 5th fret. It goes on the E string. Uh, it starts there. And then it goes to the 7th. Open on the A string. 5th, 7th. And then it's closed it on the 5th and then on the 7th so I'll show you that again it goes and again ok that was
was the first bit of the verse. I had to cut the recording because I bugged it up. And the second bit, okay, is the same, sort of similar to the first bit, except it doesn't have the riff in. Uh, it's slightly different. Um, so you're picking between again the A and the D. Uh, so this bit is the same. It's then the A string goes open again. full speed is okay do you want to show that I'll show you that once more so it's Sorted. Um, I'll show you the chorus. Uh, it does the obviously on the end of the verse. It does the rundown riff here. I'll try and move my guitar back so you can see it. it does the rundown riff, and then he slides up. I'll show you the chords first. Okay. First one is the eighth fret on the uh, A string and the tenth fret on the G string. Okay, that's the first one. The second one is index finger on the E string on the seventh fret. Uh, the A string's muted. And then it's the two strings below that, so the on the same fret, um, the D string and the G string on the seventh fret. So you're playing, you don't play the bottom string on this. It's just the B string, uh, G string, D string, and E string. Just those four strings. And then that's the second chord. Third chord, you slide back two two frets to the fifth fret. Everything in the fifth fret, and then it's just open. Okay, so I'll just play that through. So it does the Okay, after that, but on the last bit the strumming pattern changes. So all he's doing basically is the thumb and then these three fingers, okay, together on the B, G and D string. So it's root note. So it's seventh fret, fifth fret, in the confines of fear. Does this for a little while and then it does the intro riff again. Start again. Intro riff again. <laughs> then back into the verse riff. Okay, hold it there. We'll come back and we'll do the bridge. There you go. Hope you're getting on alright. Um, so we've got the intro first. Then we've got the two verses. So you play uh, basically the verse section that I showed you already uh, through twice. And then it goes into the chorus section, uh, which is this bit. Okay, once you finish the, it does the intro riff again. Okay, then we have another verse. I'll play it for you quickly. Twice. 
slightly different this time. The riff isn't, sorry. Plays it through completely through twice, and then you go up to the A string, do the same riff on the same frets. And finish here. Okay, so I'll show you that once more slowly. Okay, the bridge is the same chord shapes as we played in the chorus, but you go back to the, you start on the seventh fret, so it's so tenth. does that a few more times doesn't it? I've been worrying, I've been and then he finishes with a whole bar chord. song. Okay guys, just to recap, we've got the intro section, we've got the verse which you play through twice, uh, followed by the chorus, followed by the intro, verse, chorus, intro, bridge. That's the whole song done. Um, I hope you liked the video, I hope you found it useful, and I hope you can play the song quicker than I can. <laughs> Good. Um, I've got some of my own covers on, on my channel. Um, if you like the video, feel free to subscribe, check them out, leave your feedback, uh, let me know what you think, I'd love to hear your feedback. Um, I'm on Facebook, Twitter and all that stuff. Um, I'll stop rambling now and let you get on with practicing. Thanks very much. Cheers, guys. Bye.